look at Woody for a while. Why? Hey, wait. Hey, Woody. Woody. Hey, you. <laughs> you eat your Woody's? You eat your Woody? <laughs> what? <laughs> what? You getting happy? Happy Woody? <gasps> What's that? What's that? <gasps> <gasps> Shh! I'm letting you have my Billy video. You're not supposed to be in this one. Billy's supposed to be in this one. Ready? Light goes off. Light goes on. Light goes off. Light goes on. God, you don't really see you because it's so you're so dark. Hey, so show on your teeth. Ever, ever. Oh, has got a big mouth. Put my mouth hand in it. <laughs> Would he say <so> happy? <gasps> what do you want to say? What do you want some of my dinner? Yum. Some of my dinner? I see you lick it, but you don't eat it. Right, back to Billy. Turn the light off. Oops, you have to turn the light. So, I'm just going to turn this off. Huh. My sock drawer is open. Okay. Oh, there he goes. He's starting to eat it. Really big is big in my wrist. The one thing I love about Billy is he's never disturbed by me when I film him, which is a good thing and a bad thing. Well, I don't know. I don't think it's bad, but yeah. It would be. So if my room's a bit of, bit of a mess, I haven't cleaned it up lately. <laughs> I need to though. Yeah, one day. <clears throat> For those of you who don't know, Woody's um a stuffy. Very special stuffy, aren't you, Woody? Huh? You're a good boy, aren't you? And Billy is a coastal carpet python. If you have seen um the very first videos of him, like they weren't from when I first got him, but I've got some pretty recent ones on there. So, the ones I do have of them are first, that was a year or so after I had them. I wouldn't be a couple of months after I got them, because um, now, he's about a year and a half old. Um, he's about seven foot long. He's about eight kilos. And he's just a huge snake. Because most of them are still in his log, that's something of it. And the meal does seem a bit small, but that's the only thing I can get them at the moment, because um, that's uh, the biggest size they had, all the other ones, um, yeah, the bigger ones were all sold out. Because usually I give them adult, or large adult rats. This one's here, only a medium. 
I guess medium is normal. It's doing really good. This video, this um, feeding part of the video is going to be three parts. Just uh, filming this on my iPhone 4. So hopefully it turns out alright. I'll get some footage of me getting I'll get closer so I can get better footage. This log here, he loves this log very much, his favourite thing in the world, which kind of makes me sad because I'm not. And um, we got this log near Murray Bridge in South Australia, it was still on the tree, we cut it down, oh, <clears throat> before we cut it, we knocked on it and a whole pile of bats flew out. But um, my dad's mate Zach, his father cut it down, yep, and he's loved it. Oh, he spends all his time in it now. Except for when he's hungry, then he just searches around his cage. I need to get a bigger cage soon, because this is only a uh, four foot by two and a half by two and a half. So, obviously, foot. Four foot in a width, uh, two and a half in depth, and two and a half in height. Looking for a bigger one. See so if any of you guys can suggest a bigger one. That'd be great. And like the realize that I'm in a Adelaide, South Australia, so anything near there would be good. This snake has gotten that used to me um a while ago when we were staying at my dad's girlfriend's house. I had um when we were living there, um, I was feeding him outside in the grass, and um, this when I was feeding him chickens, and he was enjoying it and all that. Next minute, sudden, you see his head pop up with half the chicken in his mouth, comes over towards me, and there was, there was ants on him. So I picked, um, he climbed up on me. I picked him up, and he was eating his rat while um, his chicken while I was holding him. Oh my god, Billy. You're such a camera attention hog, aren't you? There's some big balls in the rat. Oh. Doing it really good, Billy. Um. Re oh, I don't know. In a couple of days, I'll do um, a video of me cleaning out his cage. Because, um, I can't really clean it out now because it's, well, last couple of days because it's just been under 16 degrees. So I'm going to try to keep it warm because, um, what I have is, if I can get up, is this green carpet. I found I find it easier to maintain than the actual rocks themselves. Oh, it it's not as easy to maintain as rocks, but like the little rocks I have at the back. <laughs> 